What's going on here is the bed of the CNC is not quite big enough to fit all three of these leaves on there at once. It's not Jackman sized, but let's face it, neither is this shop. So what I ended up doing is using the center point of the compass rose for my zero, zero. You can't see it all here, but it'll cut everything that's off the sheet anyway. So I just split this off into two separate tool paths, one for these two leaves, and then the second one for the third leaf. So let's go. <laughs> Hey guys, thank you for watching, and a big shout out goes to Waterlocks for making this video possible. Now you guys know this already, but Waterlocks hands down is my favorite finish. It's a tongue oil resin mix that really soaks into the grain to give you an awesome depth, and then the resin gives you the subtle shine to the surface. It is also waterproof and food safe, and maybe even water safe and food proof, so it's perfect for a countertop like this. I'll leave a link in the description so you can learn all about Waterlocks, if you don't have it in your shop yet, you are falling behind. 
So definitely go check it out. Also, I'm teaming up with Inventables to kick off the Power Hour Carving Challenge with this project. And it's all just about designing a project that has less than an hour total in cut time. This one clocked in at about 55, 56 minutes, so just under the cutoff. And you don't even need a machine to enter into this contest because that is the grand prize. So just follow the link down below to Easel. That's their CNC software and you do all the work right in there. And lastly, I feel like this project deserves a little bit of an explanation. So what this is, is actually three table leaf countertop sections that are going to live on top of a half wall in my friend's house. So it's a pretty small house that lacks countertop space, so this will help out a ton when they have people over and need a little bit more room. So this just lives above the stairs temporarily, and if they don't need it, it's in the three sections, so they can easily tuck it away inside of a closet somewhere. Anyway, thank you for watching. Go check out Waterlocks. They are a huge supporter of what I do, and I wouldn't endorse a product unless I really believed in it. But that's it for now. I'll see you next time.